What's going on, pretty people? I'm your host, Pretty Boy King, bringing you something super exciting. Uh, Pokemon Sun and Moon announcement. This trailer is titled Explore the Alo Alola Region in Pokemon Sun and Pokemon Moon. Now, I am freaking excited because I didn't know this was happening. I was talking to J-Dubs yesterday. He's like, dude, Pokemon news, 9 a.m. our time. And I was like, oh, oh, no way. And he sent me the text this morning. And I just woke up. My stomach hurts. I ate so much Taco Bell last night. Oh my god. So much. But it was so good. And now I just feel gross and realize I need to start working out. And oh, life problems, you know? Anyway, let's watch this because I'm freaking excited. Okay. What's up, Pikachu? Powerful? Let's just. So, Galio, Psychic Steel! Wait, is that already a thing? Full Metal Body. Full Metal Body. Oh. All that power. Oh! Fucking jumped and the dirt came out. What? Oh, Yvonne. Oh, look at those new health bars. I love that little scribble. Lunala. Lunala, that's a cool name. That's a cool name. Psychic Ghost. Look at that, this, is, this thing's creepy as hell. Lunala. What's up, girl? Oh, look at that, the ground! Oh, the ground comes up. Oh, you can see space in her head! Moongeist Beam! Look at the little scribble in the background. What? It's islands? What? What? The trainers? What? Oh, custom. Oh, yes, Professor Kuki. Oh, look at this guy! Look at this guy! He's a professor? Mysterious assistant? Your new friend? There's a Rotom in your Pokédex? What? I don't know- What? Okay, wait, is there a UK edition? Let's let's check it out. Let's check it out. Okay, it looks the same. Okay, look at the streaks, that color streak. It's like right it's like like like, you know, water paint or whatever the hell it's called. Look at the dirt popping up. Oh look at this power. Oh, that looks like a fucking Digimon move. Yes! Lunala. No, that is such a good name. Shadow Shield. What does it do? Shadow Shield. What does Shadow Shield do? What does Shadow Shield do? Look at space is in its body. Look at this. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Oh, creepy. Moongeist Beam! Not gonna lie, but it's power. Look at different islands. Can we just pause? Can we just pause and go back? Oh my god. Oh my god, look at this. Okay. So we have... This looks like just a thing of pancakes. That, that's a volcano. There's another place. And then another... It's like four different islands. And we got one in the background right here. There's some boats. Oh, this looks like a place with legendary Pokemon. I feel like that's gonna be a story part right here. And then there's like a little center right here. I don't know what that is. And there's a lighthouse. We got like a deco over here. Yo, that's gonna be cool. Huh. Now let's look, let's think about the character designs right here. They look super young, like they literally look really young. Like you can look at these guys and be like, "That's young." I mean, she literally looks like she's fourteen. He looks like he looks like freaking G Dragon when G Dragon started out as a trainee. That's funny. That's funny. Let's go. Okay. This guy is the professor. Did not see that coming at all. Look at this guy. Look at him. 
is a region made up of several islands, so not just the four, it looks like at least five. There, that could be the reason the region is chock full of nothing but rare Pokemon. Yeah! A mysterious assistant. Okay, look at this bridge. Oh, that's gonna be terrifying to cross. Okay, she looks so lost. Then she looks pissed. Mm. Li Lily, what's going on? Okay. How we got the professor? We got the professor in the background. Then who is this guy? Cause I thought this was the professor. That gave me chicken skin. Okay, what? That's just. This is cute. Okay, this is where it gets kind of weird. There's a Rotom in your Pokédex. Like, what does that mean? Nice to meet you, pal. Gentle on the goods, okay? But it's only complete once Rotom has gone. That's so weird! Does that mean we get like seven Pokémon? Or does it let us talk? actually talk to our Pokémon? On the 23rd. Okay, so I say let's watch that one more time. Yep, okay, let's go to the fir let's first go to the main Pokemon channel, okay? Here we go. Is there anything else? No. No, it doesn't look like it. Okay, let's watch this one more time. Ooh, whoa, it's way too big. Okay, here we go. We're gonna do it, like, frame by frame, almost. Okay. Powerful Legendary Pokemon. Okay, we got... Sol... Solgaleo? Solgaleo? So, okay, not as cool of a name. But, are there any Psychic Steel types? I can't think of any. Psychic Steel Pokemon. Oh no, there's Metagross. That's right. There's Metagross. Oh, then there's Bronzong. Or Bronzong. I guess those are like the only two I can think of. Or C. Yeah, I forgot about them. Let's go. Okay, Full Metal Body. What does that do? That just prevents low ridge of stats, right? Full Metal Body. Pokemon. Oh, is he like the only guy with the nature? Okay, here we go. Let's look at this, guys. Here we go. Look at this. Nope. Okay, that works. Okay, so we got legendaries named other details revealed for Pokemon Sun and Moon. Also showcasing the twist the player's Pokemon. Yeah, an electro type that. Oh, that's so weird. A chain of islands. The stats can be lowered by attack and has a signature move with Sunsteel Strike. Ability Shadow. Here, let's look, let's look up right here. A, ooh. With the Shadow Shield ability, a Pokemon will take less damage from an attack that lands when the Pokemon is full HP. So it's kind of like multi scale. Oh, that's kind of OP. Oh, in Pokemon Sun and Moon. Pokemon Sun and Pokemon with a QR scanner function allows players to see information about Pokemon when they scan QR code pads by scanning to fancy members of Pokemon and of the lower to their find out where they live. Oh, this is interesting. This is really interesting. Okay, but let's continue the trailer. Okay, so his design looks sick. Intimidate, yeah, suck it. Okay, look at this. See, look at this color streak right here. It looks like a paint streak, like a pastel, like swoosh. That looks so nice. I really like that. And then the health bar. It seems more. Ca it seems more casual. Is what the health. The health bar just seems more, like more casual, laid back. I mean, I like how it goes from light green to dark green. That's pretty cool. And Soul Galio has so much health. Solga. Solgaleo. 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 Solgaleo? Solgaleo. Yvonne. Okay, look at the space. You can see space in their head. Look at this. Oh, just look at the dirt. Oh, the dirt. He jumps up and dirt explodes. That's cool. Look at this move. Oh my gosh. That looks just... It looks like 
War Greymon's like one move. What's his final move? We're gonna look what what it's called. Is it called Nova Destroyer? War Greymon. War Greymon X. Holy, that looks cool. Look at that. Look how awesome that looks. Sick. Okay, anyway, I don't know what it's called. That's what it looks like. And look at that explosion. Oh, that does massive damage. It looks like a fire attack. Okay, Lunala. Great freaking name. Uh, the bat. I feel like... I feel like this would have been like, I mean, I can't say bug because bats are animal, animals, but psychic sounds legit, ghost, uh, uh, I mean, what kind of resistance is, I mean, dark four times right here, fairy, no, not fairy, I don't know, but cha cha, I mean, it'll be, you know, me to ghost. Oh, see the ground again, and look at this, you can see space in its freaking head. It has space head, and then an eye. Gosh, a freaking Pegasus, or Yugi. Okay, so that must have been Ghost. Okay, here we go, look at this. Here's the map without the words. We got at least four major islands, then like a little resort, that's what that looks like. An island out here. And we got this one. So I feel like you start here, or here, and then just go in an arc. I mean, but look how varied these environments look like. This looks like a plateau sort of thing. This looks like a lush, you know, more even, plain out, like, local thing. This looks like, like a volcano place, or like a more lush forest-like thing. Looks like a beach, you know, and then this is like a volcano, then we got snow up here. So we got, like... You got lava, you got like a desert going on, you got well, like a desert-ish area, you got lush forests. I mean, you got a lot of like various environments. And like right here, it looks like boats travel between islands. So that looks legit. This, I, I feel like there's something right there, look at that. Uh, it's interesting. It's interesting. Oh, there's a cave. Oh, look at that. Okay, this looks very open. I mean, look how open this looks. It does look really lush. Okay, can we go back to... Here's... This looks like a main city. We got palm trees. It does look kind of empty. The places do. Okay. I really like how the blonde girl looks right here. That, yeah, I really like that. Probably rocking this one, yeah. But I am glad they're bringing back Turner Customization. But they literally look like they're 14. Okay. They literally look young. Okay, he is the professor, which kind of blows my mind, because I thought he was, like, your... He is your cousin, isn't he? And I thought that old guy was the professor anyway. Okay, so he's just made up of several islands, so there's at least, you know, that many. See, this looks like the main region. Where we stick it to. And he says the reason is chock full of nothing but rare Pokemon. So, hopefully he's right. Lily, this girl, I don't know why they would introduce her. I feel like she might be part of the story. So that's interesting. And then this guy, he loves chicken skin. That gave me chicken skin. I don't know what that means. What does... What does gave me chicken skin mean? Oh, okay, it's apparently slang for goosebumps. Alright, but we gotta see, I thought this guy was a professor. But no, he is. I thought this was a professor's assistant. And then this girl looks like, uh, what's her name? The blonde chick from The Walking Dead that died last season. Uh, spoiler alert. Um, what's her name? Maggie's sister. And who knows. And then this thing. Okay, Rotom in your Pokédex. I wonder if you can use this, actually. Like, I don't understand what, I don't, is this because it allows you to scan the QR codes? Is that why? Is it like the only way? I don't know. I really don't know. I don't get that. Yeah, so it looks like, 
Uh, it looks interesting. Like I'm not gonna lie, it does. Uh, I was hoping for like like Mega Evolution reveals or Sun and Moon Trainer fusions. What? Oh, it's a theory. Okay, that's weird. Anyway, I'm gonna watch this anyway though. But no, that I was hoping for like Mega Evolution reveals, but I guess that you have to introduce the legendaries. Then you got, you know, summer coming up, so there's got bound to be more news, but, huh. That's interesting. Very interesting. I don't know, I just, oh, I just want more information. I want to be able to, like, have my Pokemon follow me. That'd be so cool. And I'm really curious about, like, how the whole multiple islands will work. And how big each one is. And, uh, and then I want to know how many, like, new Pokemon they're bringing to the, you know, field. I don't know. I'm just so excited, yo. I'm so excited. So, thank you guys for watching. I'm your host, Pretty Boy King. And you all, all stay pretty out there. And then leave in the comment section below, I forgot to mention this, what you think, like, any theories you have about Pokemon Sun and Moon, share in the comment section below, and uh, we'll see, uh, like, if you're right, I mean, like, get the conversation going. I mean, this game, I'm like so excited for this game. I'm so hyped. I'm so hyped. I'm more hyped than Mass Effect because Bioware hasn't released anything for Mass Effect yet. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Have yourself a great, have yourself a great day and always stay pretty.